This is Coyote News. The Coyote women's golf team finished up the Saluki Invitational on Monday. Coyote News' Heath Nimke spoke with a member of the team who's off to a great start to her spring season. Heath. Thanks, Caleb. Brenna Lervick has two consecutive run-up finishes this spring. I spoke with her earlier today about how she's gotten off to such a great start. You've had a couple of run-up finishes this year. What have you done to prepare yourself? Um, I think a lot of what comes with success is mental preparation and our coaches have been doing a really good job of helping us get to that next level in the mental game and just making sure that you're always sticking with that one shot you're on right now and you're not trying to go too far forward or too far in the past because otherwise that can just mess with your game and doesn't make you successful. How has the weather been a player uh, factor I guess this year? Um, it makes it difficult when we aren't able to play all year and it kind of shows in the first tournament you'll notice that not everybody's a used to walking 18 holes or 36 holes in a day that can be kind of tiring and as well as you don't really know which way you're missing it hitting into the dome we only get 10 yards really that we can look at and try to guess ball fight from there and a lot of that kind of comes in to play and you're just trying to figure out what your misses are and play to that. What have you been doing to prepare yourself for the next upcoming meets? Well, I mean, obviously the end game is the conference tournament that we have at, down in Nebraska City. And I think a lot of us are just, again, trying to get the mental preparation. We're all good enough to go out and compete with all teams at the Summer League. I mean, this year we've shown we've come back from a 26 deficit almost to win a tournament, as well as we've beaten the some of the Summit League uh, competitors such as North Dakota State, Oral Roberts, and we've come close to beating South Dakota State, so it's just a matter of who's got the game for the day. The women's golf team has two more meets on the schedule before they play for the Summit League title. For Coyote News, I'm Heath Nimke.